Hi, you folks, Gord Pizer here. I want to show you something I discovered at the iCast show in Orlando this year uh, of new products coming out. It's, it's called a rock lease, and it's made by a company called EcoLeaser. Pretty simple looking device, probably the best conservation tool I've come across in the past 20 or 30 years. Now, barrel trauma, I'm sure you've all heard about barrel trauma, and what barrel trauma is. When a fish is in 28 or more feet of water, that's one atmosphere. Now, if you were a diver and you took down a balloon, a little small balloon with a tiny bit of air in it, and you're down in 28, 30, 40 feet of water, and you let that balloon come up to the surface, because of the reduction in pressure, the balloon expands, it gets bigger and bigger, and depending on how deep you are, as it gets right to the surface, it could explode. That's how big it, because of the lack of pressure. That's exactly what happens inside a walleye, a yellow perch, a smallmouth bass, when you catch it in 28, 30, 40 feet of water. Its air bladder starts to expand. And if you've caught a fish that's done that, sometimes you'll see the eyeballs starting to uh, extrude, and you'll often see the fish's stomach coming out its mouth. Now that's its stomach coming out its mouth, not its swim bladder, but the swim bladder's expanding so much it's actually forcing its stomach out. Here's the best way to counteract that. It's one of these tools, and what you do is you take this rock lease, you open it up, and you'll see it's got a, uh, on the lower clip here, it's got a piece of plastic. You put that on the jaw, the lower jaw of the fish, and then just barely clip it on. I've got about eight ounces of weight on that. I put it in my hole when I'm ice fishing, and I let that go back down. Or if I'm fishing over the side of the boat, I just release it and let it go to the bottom. And here's the neat thing, when you do that, when you put that walleye or crappie or, or smallmouth bass back down in 28, 30 feet of water, you actually feel it starting to struggle. And it's telling you, hey, the, I feel pretty good back down here. I've, I've neutralized, I've equalized my pressure. Give it one pop, it snaps off and the fish swims away. We've been doing it all this winter with crappies and you watch them on your sonar. They never rise back up, they swim perfectly away along the bottom. Now, I know a lot of folks uh, like to stick needles in and, and it's called fizzing, but when you try and fizz a fish, when you try and reduce the air inside, it's almost impossible to avoid hitting vital organs, hearts, livers, intestines. It's really, really difficult. You get yourself one of these rock leases made by the Eco Leaser Company. It is the best conservation tool I've come across in 30 years. You put it in your boat this year, take it ice fishing, you'll be doing more in terms of good conservation than you can imagine.